I really believe that she said nothing wrong. She spoke the truth. You just said that she made some offensive remarks, and I saw the, the short um, television uh, report of what she said. And unfortunately, um, uh, that was uh, nothing uh, but the truth. She spoke about uh, Mohammed and how he married and consummated a marriage with uh, Aisha, a young girl of nine years old, and, and that happened. I mean, it's, it's in the hadith. She was speaking the truth, and we might not like the truth, but it's still the truth. And I think it's very unfair um, for um, so many people, um, and, and especially outside of uh, India and nations that have uh, the worst track record themselves when it comes to human rights, um, and to push her and to threaten her. I mean, she's threatened uh, um, to be killed and uh, for speaking the truth. And I really have to stand up and support her because I experienced it myself some years ago. Uh, I'm living in the government safe houses for 14 years now because I also criticize Islam. And I see Haya, this brave in, um, young politician in India, um, having the same prospects. And uh, somebody, we should stand up and support her.